Hey guys, how's it going? Um, popping on here uh, to talk about the Connecticut real estate market. And this is for October 24th, 2023. And you can see here on, uh, on this side, we're talking about September 22 versus September 23. Um, and this is year to date 22 over year to date 23. And new listings year to date, you can see they're at almost 25% change, and that is down, 25% down. Uh, pending sales uh, also makes sense. They're also 22% down, and uh, you'll see everything is down here because there is very little available to buy. Closed sales down almost 25%. Days on market until sale is down slightly. Um, from 35 to 34 down three uh, percent that's year over year and what does that mean for prices they are up folks look at that so people a lot of people are talking about interest rates mm -hmm. and how uh, nobody wants to buy a house at eight percent um, or even seven percent but what's happening is there's so little inventory on the market uh, the prices are actually going up and also just so you know uh, interest rates at seven or eight at 410,000 when they go down and what goes up must come down interest rates when they come off to six percent or five percent or even seven percent this price is going to go up because this number over here available new listings that is going to go up we've seen this in the past couple of years go to 50 percent so down so just keep that in mind you can refinance your interest rate you cannot refinance your purchase price um, and this next slide will show you the affordability where we're at now this is single family in here and this is a year to date also 2021 we we're at 163 last year we we're at 113 this year we're at 97 so an affordability index at 100 means that at the median household income, you will uh, qualify for the median priced home. But this graph shows that we are currently at 97, which means if you make the median priced income, you cannot afford the median priced home. So uh, you can see what direction that's going in. Um, and, you know, some of this has to do with interest rates. A lot of it has to do with supply and demand, mainly, because there's just not a lot out there to buy. So hopefully this information was helpful to you guys. If you want to talk about your specific situation, as always, you can feel free to reach out to me at 860-833-6795. That's my wife, and I am 860-982-7696. And thanks a lot for watching, guys. Have an awesome day.